whenever you write a little piece of code and you patch it up into a nice piece of software or an app, did you ever wonder what that compilation process is? You know, when you click build and your computer goes off and does something for a few minutes or a few seconds. Well, what it's doing is it is compiling your program. And all that compilation is, is a translation process. So it's going from a language that we can understand as programmers, and it is translating it into a language that a processor on another computer or an operating system can understand. Now, this other language would be very, very difficult for us to read as humans, but it makes complete sense to a computer. Now, the next time you go and write a piece of software, it will be in a certain language, Java, C, it doesn't really matter. Then you will actually have a choice of compilers. And those compilers will allow you to run that code on a different platform. So you can take your code and you can translate it through the compiler into a bit of language that any other kind of computer will understand. Now you can't do this for every language that's out there, but a lot of them do have what's called cross compilers. So that's what a compiler is. It is basically translating your code into code that a different machine can understand.